What's up guys, the German here again and welcome to Score More Still More episode 4 with West Ham United and this series is all about using the in-game editor of the game and uh, basically having fun and here are the rules uh, if somebody have forgotten of those if you win you win the highest rated players of your opposing team and of course if you lose you lose your highest rated players for, for that team um, if draw occurs in the game we swap goal scorers um, but if the scoreline is uh, scoreless nil nil then nothing will happen hopefully those won't happen too often we had one in uh, the first episode but hopefully not too many many after that and of course winning and losing margin decides how many players you win or lose um, and like you did remember last episode we did lose 5-1 uh, to Manchester City so we did lose four players four players to Man City and um, yeah of course uh, in the second episode also we did uh, win a game against Alta 1-2-1 one, one scoreline so we did win one Alta player for that and if we score four goals or more in a game we can choose the players we are swapping example if we did uh, some uh, strange way win 4-2 against some team we can choose the two players we are taking and of course if we manage to lose game by say 5-4 uh, and uh, therefore we have scored four goals then we also can can choose what player we are losing so hopefully you understand that and of course if some of our players will score a hat-trick in a game uh, we can choose one extra player of our choice so those are the rules once again and uh, yeah let's get going and uh, like you are seeing here in the last episode we did lose to Man City and lost a lot of players and of course we did win game against Altak 2-1 scoreline but today today we are facing Manchester United and Altak in that second leg of that playoff round so first things first let's go and face Manchester United so here we are and today we are lining up with Adrian in goal, Aaron Cresswell, uh, Angela Ogbona, Winston Reid and Carl Jenkinson our defensive line. Uh, Petro Obiang and Chiku Kiate in midfield and uh, in attacking positions Michael Antonio in left, Dimi Paye in middle, Quincy Broms in right hand side and Harry Kane, of course, is starting as a striker. In bench, we have Darren Randolph, James Tompkins, Sam Byram, Andy Carroll, Bruno Soares, Israel, and Anatoly Timonchuk. And let's get going, and hopefully we can we can perform better than against City uh, in the last episode, and uh, maybe snatch a point or win the game and gain some good players. Weinsteiger in the ball now closing down. Mata tried to find Valencia but Creswell was there. Now Kiate got the ball. Finds Paye. Can he play through? No. Antonio cross the box. Cross the box. Cross there but Harry Kane haven't been that good lately. Paye play through. Of course when you are doubting the Harry Kane hunger to score goals then he strikes back and yeah we are leading 1-0 and with this goal line we are stealing the highest rated Manchester United player and uh, uh, magnificent through ball by Dimitri Paye and Harry Kane is on on there and scoring the goal third goal of the year for him the the hair try to find Rooney now closing down, good tackle by Obiang. Herrera takes the ball though. Mata finds Memphis and Memphis debate. One all. Uh, not that good. Good defending and with this goal line we are swapping the goal scorers. 
so we would get Memphis Depay and uh, yeah, Harry Kane would go to Man United and that is something we don't wanna want to happen so let's encourage the players definitely encourage Obian got the ball try to find Antonio yet again Damian would uh, clear it yet again now Kane Timmy Baye finds Bronze go forward try to cross it Kiate Baye through ball no, Jenkinson in the wing, Proms back to Jenkinson, now cross it, back post Harry Kane, into the middle and to the back post, goal and we are leading 2-1 scoreline, Harry Kane, fourth goal of the year, second for the game, Proms play through ball nicely to Carl Jenkinson in the, at the wing and Harry Kane, calm and collective, in, into the back post, nothing Nothing the hair can do about that, and the first highlight, uh, first, and the first half is over also, and yeah, really, really good performance. I I truly enjoy that. Jenkinson try to find Bronze, get it back to Jenkinson, cross the ball in the back post. Israel is there, uh, and now Man United are counter attacking. Come on, guys! Now we need to defend. Rooney got the ball. Find Schneiderlin. Back to Memphis. To Rooney. Daily Blind. Back to Rooney. Broms tackles. Good tackle by Quincy Broms. Now don't foul them. Oh man! Wayne Rooney score. First goal of the year for Wayne Rooney. And mm, I'm not happy about it. Daily Blind got the ball. Read good tackle and Rooney plastic to the back of the net and uh, I don't know Adrian wasn't on the on the place there Daily Blind no don't let them score Memphis to Bayer Bayer got the ball back to Hurricane now back to Bayer Obiang finds Dimonchuk now into the wing Quincy Proms are oh, poor poor by Quincy Proms and the game is over Oh man, it's too all. And here you can see, because the score lining is too all, we are swapping goal scorers. And today, Harry Kane scored both of our goals. So we t we need to say goodbye for Harry Kane. And Man United, you are going. So bye bye, Harry Kane. Oh man, it's shame to lose that good player. But in the uh, other hand. We are gaining two players and today Man United goal scorers are Memphis Depay and Wayne Rooney and uh, yeah really really good players both Memphis Depay and Wayne Rooney good players the rules are the rules and there's nothing we can do just go forward to the next game and today we are facing all dark in that second leg and for the first leg we are gaining one goal uh, lead to, for going this game and today we are lining a uh, Randolph in goal, Creswell, Ogbonna, Tompkins, Byram in defensive line, Duits, Kiate in midfield, Israel in left, Paye in middle, Proms in right hand side and making his debut this season Andy Carroll who have come back for for the injury and starting today. In bench we have Adrian, Winston Reed, Carl Jenkinson, Pedro Obiang, Bruno Zares, Wayne Rooney and Anatoly Timochuk. Uh, we are saving Memphis Depay for the future and won't risk, probably not gonna risk Wayne Rooney either so, but still in the bench. Let's get going. And we are starting the home game with Haminator Tactic and yeah, hopefully we could win the game and go for the Europa League group stage where, the, where we can win a lot of good players. But Altak are attacking long ball Tompkins to Randolph and we take the control of the ball. Andy Carroll to Dimitri Payet. Oh yeah, got space, tried it to shoot and gone over. Not a shot on target yet. Oh yeah. Carol, Proms, 
can he score? Foul! And we win a penalty. Who will take it? Is it? Is it um, Timmy Trifaye or Andy Carroll? Which one is number nine? Andy Carroll. And man, what is that thing for those penalties? Yet another highlight. Creswell finds Paye to Isaiah. Front post. No, it's gone to the home. Oh my Similar goal to what we did see last night in Euros when Hungary equalized the game against Iceland when uh, Icelandic defenders slided to the ball into the own net. Creswell free kick finds Carroll's head and it's 2 0. First goal of Andy Carroll this season and we are leading 2 0 and it seems that we are going to the Europa League group stage. And uh, nice, nice goal here. Good header by Carroll and Golden that don't reach the ball, and it's 2 0. Bronze. Schönlechner fouled it, and it's a second yellow, and he's off. Our job is getting much easier. And can we score two more goals? That would mean that we can choose the players that we are taking. Isai is scoring third goal. Time and we are leading 3-0, we need, only need one more goal and we can decide the players that we are taking. And uh, yeah, I know that Alta team don't, doesn't have any good players, but at least some guys would be good and the first half is over. And let's say passionately very pleased how the game is going. I don't know, should I take Andy Carroll off and give him a rest and bring Wayne Rooney for the second half? Uh, Carroll is knackered, but let's keep him around uh, 10 minutes or so for the second half and then take him off. 50 minutes already almost gone. Isal got the ball now. There is space. Creswell, cross it, back post, brittle, clears it, Tompkins. To Kiate, Byram, and cross it to the box, and Andy Carroll's second goal. And yeah, we are leading 4 0, and now we can decide the players that we are taking from Alta. And uh, yeah, really, really, really dom dominant performance so far. Do two goals for Andy Carroll, and can he score the one more goal? I give him. Uh, couple of more minutes. Let's bring Wayne Rooney for Dimitri Payet and give Payet the rest and give 85th fourth minute and uh, let's make one more substitution. Who should we bring in? Uh, let's bring Bruno Zara's take uh, Tompkins off. Give, give those guys a game and uh, Tompkins some rest at the end of the game. 4-0 scoreline seems to be... Yes, it is. West Ham 4, Alba 0 and really solid performance and with this scoreline we are stealing 4 Alta players and let's go see those guys who we are picking up. And I'm, I'm scrolling down the players here but like you are seeing, there are not many players with with attributes at all. Uh, I don't know, is it the fact that I don't have the Austrian league turned on? Or is it that the players don't exist, that they are the grey out? Let's see the team, let's go. If we look to... yeah, they are... They are all grey out players, there are only two players three players but Roth didn't play for the game so the, therefore he he is not not coming for us our team Calvao and Cesar Ortiz are the only players that did feature that game that are real life players so so we are taking those two guys moving to my club welcome to West Ham United or team and Calvao also welcome 
to West Ham United. And, and that is no. that. Two games and two games without losing. Uh, still a bit annoyed about the fact that we did draw the game against Man United. We should have won the game. We were leading two in two occasions. And uh, yeah, we did lose Harry Kane for the game. But then we bounced back against Alta and did win the playoff round. And we are going for the group stage for Europa League. And um, in next episode we are seeing the group stage draw and play two games against West Brom and Everton. And uh, yeah, hopefully we could snatch some good players on those games. But yet again, thank you for watching. Thumb up if you did like the video and if you are new, new in my channel, please subscribe. Subscribe to the channel, it, it will help the channel grow and uh, it's always enjoyable to do videos when you know that there are people who are watching this. So, yet again, thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next episode.